You know, so many bombs. They were ear shattering. It was the first thing that you could hear. It whistles. It was a warning that the Japanese were coming. We saw more and more bombs falling. Some of them fell on ships at sea. We could see them sinking from afar. We could see the fighting. Americans versus the Japanese. Japanese planes had red circles. American planes don't. When I was 13 or 14 years old, I was drying rice on the pavement when a platoon of soldiers came marching by. There were seven of us working, and the Japanese soldiers grabbed us. They brought us to the Emilio Jacinto Elementary School, which they had turned into a garrison. Inside the room where they took me, several Japanese soldiers took turns raping me. After the third soldier, I lost consciousness. When I regained consciousness, I was in a toilet and a woman was washing me. I did not know who she was. When she had finished, she brought me back to the room. I stayed in the garrison after that. In the mornings, they would let the women in the sun, but still inside the garrison. They made us wash clothes, wash dishes, sweep the floors. In the night, they would rape us. At first, I could do nothing but cry. It was so painful. I felt like I was dying. When I tried to resist, they would kick me, slap me in the face. After a time, I had lost the strength to fight. 